I am going to create a folder redirection GPO and then we are going to redirect one of the folders to another location. So how you do it, you need to first go on to your first server, which is your domain controller. And then within the domain controller, you need to open group policy management. And within group policy management, all you need to do, uh, scroll down to group policy objects. And within this, right click on the group policy object and just say new. And when you say new here, and name it according to what settings you are you, creating this policy for. So in our case, we are going to create a setting for folder redirection. So folder redirection. So I'm going to create a policy for folder redirection and you just create an empty GPO. Once empty GPO is created, all you need to do, right click on that GPO and then edit. Then you need to edit it. And once you edit it, then what we need to do, we need to go to uh, policies under computers, under computer settings. Okay, yes, user settings. Which one? So let's make it very simple. Let's make it very simple. Let's make it very simple. So let's make it very simple. So guys, my, my, my point here is, my point here is, first of all, first of all, there is nothing complicated. There is nothing complicated. So first, when you say it is complicated, it becomes complicated. So what, what I mean is, guys, in IT, there is a solution for everything. So when you are asked to do something, try to find your best way, whatever you can do. For example, guys, trust me. Trust who? Me. me. Yes. No, trust me yourself. Trust me. I don't remember. Whenever I go to a GPM, I'm always lost. So I don't remember which settings are where. But what I know is that if 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 somebody is asking me to do something, it it might be there. So I uh, I must have to try. So whenever you are asked to do something, after so many years, I don't remember which setting to go and where. So I can do my filtering, or I can I can use TechNet, not Google. Although I'm I'll be using Google, but you will never tell anyone that you're using Google. You're using TechNet. Using TechNet is allowed. Using Google is not allowed in interviews. So guys, always say TechNet, because TechNet is a Microsoft uh, uh, documentation repository. When you say TechNet, it means that you're looking for some information. When you say Google, it means you don't know anything. So this is what I'm saying. So in interviews, if you if they ask you, what do, well, how would you troubleshoot it if, if, if you don't remember anything? So your answer is, then I'm gonna I'm gonna go back to TechNet and see that what other other solutions are there. Exactly, exactly. So guys, here I'm gonna create a folder redirection. In folder redirection, you edit the policy and then you go under users configuration. You go under policies. You go under Windows settings and here there is an option called folder redirection. Now in folder redirection. In folder redirection, you can redirect many of the folders. So let's say if I go to a document folder, there is nothing inside. So let's say if you're saying I need to re I need to redirect this folder, or let's uh, let's in our case let's redirect pictures folder. So pictures folder, all you need to do select pictures folder and right click here. So folder redirection. Yes, properties. And then here, basic redirection. So so excellent. Did you knew it? You tried it. You tried it. Okay. So here, so all we need to do, right click on this and go to properties. And within properties says you can specify location for picture folder. So not configured means it will use the default location. If it is configured, you say follow the document folder, which is the default location. Basic redirect everyone everyone's folder in, to the same location and advance. Specify location for various user groups. So we're going to go to basic redirect. Just go to a basic redirect. And in a basic redirect, it says create a folder for each user under the root path. So here... Let's say, let's create a default location, and in this default location, we'll browse, just browse it. Now, now in this case, 
the uh, uh, the way corporate works that you should provide a UNC path to another server. But guys, here what we're going to do, we're going to provide a path under C drive, just to make it simpler. So you just click browse, you just click browse here and go to C drive right here within C drive and just select C drive here. So what it does, it should it should create a folder called pictures right on the C drive with the username, with the username. For now, this folder doesn't exist. So all I did was select basic redirect and then create a folder for each user. So if you have four users on different machines, it would create one folder for each user. Whoever is logging in and should create a picture. Let's see what is in the settings. In the settings, it says grant the user exclusive rights to picture, move the content of pictures to the new location and then apply redirection for all these clients, leave the folder in the new location when policy is removed. So here, yes, so target is C drive and then all we need to do, apply and say yes, and it is done. So here we redirected picture. Now, for now you don't see anything here because it is in the properties. So all we did, right click on the properties, go to properties, and here it shows me that this folder by default, default location is under my document, but now it should be under C drive directly. So, so we are redirecting this folder. Now, close this and verify this GPO settings. How do we verify GPO settings? You need to go to, you need to go to folder redirection, the GPO you just created, and then go to settings. And within settings, it shows you that you redirected pictures folder, and if you go into more detail, it is redirected to users, uh, user uh, location under pictures. Uh, so it is just, this is just to show you that what is happening with this policy. Now the second thing, did we did we configure any scope for this policy? Mm -hmm. Not yet. There is no scope for this policy. So what we are doing here is, in order to scope, we need to link it. So guys, let's link it to a domain. Let's link it to a domain. Mm -hmm. Now, now, guys, one thing that I, 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 want to, I want to share here, that ideally, we should all have a Windows 7 machine or Windows 8 machine here, and it should be joined to your network. And then with that network, it should be sitting in Toronto OU, so that we should be applying policy on OU. But for now, for Simplicity, we're applying it to a domain, so it should be applied to everyone. So now it is there. It will be applied. Now let's go to our server 2 or server 1. So even on server 1, let's see. Let's see where are my pictures folder. So my pictures folder is this. How do you know that this is my default location? In order to see if this is, for now policy is not running yet. So I'm just showing you that how to know what is your default picture location. Guys, you can go to start and open paintbrush. Open paintbrush. So, how do you open Paintbrush? Just go onto this screen and just type MS Paint. MS Paint. So, when you type MS Paint here, it shows you Paintbrush application. It shows you Paintbrush application. And within this Paintbrush application, you right click and save as. Guys, this location for now is the default location. So, default location of pictures is libraries and pictures. Now, once the policy is run, it should be changed to C drive and pictures. If the policy is running properly, then this location should be changed to C drive and pictures. So for now, I'm not saving anything here, but I'll go, uh, and since it is a user policy, how many ways the policy can be run? Three. Wait for 90 minutes, and then run GP update, or log off, log on. So here, uh, guys, this, for, uh, and guys, I, uh, now, some of the policies would require you to log off and log in. Sometimes it won't run during this. Uh, so here, let's first try to G run GP update on this. So GP update. As soon as you run GP update, it should run and then we'll see the result. GP result as well. So here, guys, it says, the group policy client side extension folder redirection was unable to apply one or more security settings because your changes must be proceeded before system start up. So here it's saying the daily wages person for folder redirection refused to work. 
He's saying, so based on this, it is saying that you must restart this machine to, to apply the policy. So, so let's restart this. So some of the policies would require a complete restart. So let's restart the server. What question? Huh? It's done? So it's fine. So sometime it gives you this message, sometime. Now open paintbrush, open paintbrush and see that if it is redirected or not. So I'm already, I've already restarted server 2 and I'm going to log in in server 2. So guys here, as you can see, right when logging in, it is also applying redirection. No, no, I, no, no, I didn't. I just restarted server 2. So here on server 2, if I go and open paintbrush, so MS Paint, let's see if folder is redirected, save as, it is not redirected. So it's not redirected, let's see why is it not redirected. So guys, in order to see, in order, it is redirected for you, okay. And, and you went into MS Paint? Huh? Sorry? Oh yes, it has to be user, but we said it should be with the username and then inside there will be a pictures folder. So here, if I go here, I should have this. Oh god, it created it. It, it redirected the folder. It did redirect the folder. So the way you know is, guys, everyone, 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 how do you verify? Now I can see administrator and within administrator my picture is right here in C administrator in pictures folder. So it did redirect this folder. It created a folder and redirected it. Now, uh, so, so now in the same manner guys, I'm going to now create a redirection for desktop. So just for another example. Okay. So just go to C drive, everyone, if, if it is run properly, just go to C drive and within C drive there is a, there should be a folder called administrator because we are logged in with administrator. Let's say if you would have been logged in with Mike, then there should be a Mike folder here. So, so in this case, it is user folder and under inside this, it automatically created a folder called my picture. Uh, which one? So here it, it is showing us. So guys, if you if you right click on pictures on this under library, this is default location, right? And if you right click on this and to see what is the actual location of this folder, go to properties, it is showing you the default location is C administrator drive. It is showing you that the folder redirection is working and your folder pictures is now redirected to C administrator and folder. Now, if it is not redirected, there must be some good reason for this. I would say just restart your machine and reapply. It is applied already. You just need to restart and re-login. Make sure you're logging in for domain. Okay. Uh, 